The youth justice system aims to meet the needs and underlying issues which impact a young person's offending behaviour. When we talk about youth justice, we're talking about children between the ages of 12 and 18 years old. The age of criminal responsibility in Scotland has recently been raised from eight years old to 12 years old, but this is still one of the lowest in Europe. Official statistics suggest that crime committed by young people is decreasing and that it's been reducing consistently for a number of years. However, we should remember that official statistics only tell us about crime which is detected, so when people get caught. Other research suggests that around 95% of children and young people are involved in low-level offending. That suggests it's a normal aspect of growing up. The systems and processes created to address offending by young people should therefore take this into account. The Scottish Youth Justice System was created through the Co-Branding Report. It said that children who come into conflict with the law should be supported based on their needs, not what they'd done wrong. Therefore, it created a single system, the Children's Hearing System, to provide support to children and young people based on their needs, not deeds. The same system deals with children who have come uh, to commit a crime, but they've also been harmed by others or need care and protection. These values are described as a welfare approach, and this welfare approach has been present in the Scottish system since then. More recently, it can be seen in policies such as Getting It Right for Every Child, GERFEC, and the Whole Systems Approach. The Whole System Approach aims to provide support to children and young people, which is holistic, which means it addresses their whole life. And this is at every stage of the justice system. The Whole System Approach includes Early and Effective Intervention, EEI, for low-level offending, diversion from prosecution, which aims to keep young people away from the criminal justice process, and reintegration and transition, supporting young people in secure care and custody and planning for their reintegration back into the community. Some children and young people who have caused harm to themselves or others may need to be looked after in secure care. There are five secure care centres in Scotland, we also have a Pullman Young Offenders Institution where young people can be held. However, recent legislation has been passed, which means that no children under 18 will be detained in prison settings. Thank you for watching. For more information about youth justice, please check out the learning resource titled Youth Justice.